we have already crossed six decades of independence and actually the economic independence also we should take into consideration the present prime minister he was the man initiated when he was the minister of finance in 1991 we had initiated the liberalization of the economy from that time onwards we could able to find some growth process in these two decades now the same gentleman is occupying the highest position and as we are sure dr manmohan singh could able to put his thoughts into practice in the next few years he was a, a he is a great economist and he was also the former president of this association economic society and the galaxy of the people are there all of say many people think that uh, uh, this is confined to a majority of the academicians academicians it's, it's not the question of academicians they should also involve in shaping the destinies of the country uh, uh, to the goals that what we have set in for this country to become a superpower we everybody now thinking of making this country a superpower by 2040 that's a, it's a great uh, uh, a thrilling effect in all of us but unless we address some of these problems and the, the growth rate is also maintained maybe very difficult and uh, the other important factor today we we are all going to discuss about this uh, uh, employment 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 comes along with the growth if the growth is there the employment will be there now the unemployment is also increasing world over globally because of the recession and also luckily india is not that much as affected because we have not that much has developed and in this process our country should take care of the employment process along with the growth so that the ideals of poverty alleviation and literacy could be maintained i am also sure that uh, as anil thakur was mentioning in the beginning that this indian economic association is going to have its centenary in 2017 95 five years another 5 year I, i hope i i will also participate in that conference so fully and uh, by that time the association must also think of having a permanent secretariat the association is having a great potentiality of bringing out its policies i am sure by 2017 at least it will have a permanent secretariat and also having a, a continuous dialogue with the policy makers so that we can put our thought process uh, and a dialogue will be opened with the policy makers to enable this country also to grow faster and also we will have a a a, a certain amount of uh, pressure we can bring on them so that the what all we are all thinking is for the betterment of the nation for the betterment of the employment for elevation of the poverty and to see that country that everybody is employed that the any policy makers the first they think that employment and employment is the only process that we could avoid poverty and this has to be taken care i'm sure that indian economy association will also i wanted to put into the brains of this the best brains of india all of them are here all the economists here so that we should not be a passive role there should also be an active role though, so that this role could also bring a part of our contribution in the development of the nation and the countries thereby the indian economic association can play a vital role thank you very much for giving me this opportunity thank you 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 th